Welcome to my channel. Today I have uh, the Ancient Stones Oracle by Rebecca Campbell. Let's, this is an Hay House deck, by the way. Um, you have seen me unboxing and having a walk through of her previous decks. All her decks have this uh, envelope style box, so you can store them like this. So I'm not sure you can see, but we have got two hands here, um, and Chester's guide me engraved at the bottom, and here on top it says Ancestors protect me. This is the back, it is $24.99 US dollars and $33.99 Canadian dollars. I am not sure how much I paid for this uh, deck, but I will link everything on the description box. So let's go and check the booklet first. So this is the the other decks by Rebecca Campbell. The Healing Waters Oracle, the one we did the one before uh, this Ancient Stones Oracle was the Healing Waters, the Rose Oracle, Virgo Light Oracle, and the Starseed Oracle. I am not sure about Virgo Light Oracle, but I have the rest. You can check it on my from from my uh, on my channel. I I am not sure whether I have that or not. I don't. I I, I think. Uh, I don't have her first deck, but I have the other ones. This is the acknowledgement. Introduction. Our sacred guides. Wisdom of the stones. The Ancient Stones, Reflections, Folklore and Myth. Uh, my journey with the Ancient Stones. Answering the Call. The Magic and Mysteries of Stones. Wisdom Keepers. Reaching back to our ancestors. Working with stones, sacred stones, megaliths and monoliths, stone circles, wise ones, holders of memory, turn to stone, connecting with our ancestors. Sorry, connecting with our ancestry. Crystals and precious stones. The sacred stone thread. Stones in rituals. rituals. Stones to heal and protect. And the oracle. This is about the oracle. The ancient stones and oracle attunement. Oh, oh, you need to scan uh, this QR code to see the, the Ancient Stones Oracle, uh, the Altar card. How to read the cards. A five-step reading. Step one, open sacred space and connect with the stones. I have a lot of uh, stones that I have collected by the by beaches. I keep them around. Step 2, shuffle and connect. Step 3, divide and spread. Step 4, select your cards. Step 5, let the... Sorry, there's something on, on my eye. 
Let the cards and the stones speak to you and through you. Depending your devotional practice with the oracle, altar work, meditating with the cards, integrating the cards guidance, soul inquiry, ancient stone activation, using oracle's box. Here you can see the um, visualization. The ancient stone and oracle card spreads, megalith, the wisdom stone, the sacred uh, mountain, the stone circle, record uh, keepers, and stepping stones. Okay, so we have finished. This one is go at the back. Um, here is we have the lithography. About the creator, Rebecca Campbell. Um, oh, she lives in uh, Glastonbury now. She was born in Australia. And about... Uh, artist okay now I can get the box and put the booklet in here because we don't we no longer need it okay ah. done so here we have the unlock the wisdom of the ancient stones. Oopsie, I didn't do it. Okay. I didn't want to damage the hang spot. Okay, here is the uh, back of the cards. Sorry, I can't really understand anything from this. Uh, so let's turn it. And this is the ancient stone oracle attunement. You need to scan the QR code. You can find free audio and visual version of the attunement.
Well, uh, my opinions about this leg is, I, I know I always tell you that I am not a great fan of Photoshop collage legs. And Rebecca Campbell's legs are one of those Photoshop collage legs. But whenever I say I will no longer buy any Rebecca Campbell deck, I find myself attracted to it. So I purchase. There is there's something unique with there is something I I I don't know what it is, but there there's something on her deck she just keeps calling me. That's why I, I buy her decks and so some of the artworks are really really nice. Some of them are not my cup of tea, but there they are easy to work with if you don't like you know her ideology or her what the things that she believes about stones and other protection or ancestral guides you don't have to have this deck it is not a must have deck but if you like her work if you follow her work and if you believe in working with guides working with stones it you can have it in your collection thank you ever so much for watching my video I will see you pretty much very soon. Uh, the earliest you can, you will be seeing this deck online. Will be probably fifth of July. Uh, since Monday, I don't have any internet connection at home. My uh, there is an issue. And on the third of July, I will be switching. To, from copper uh, fiber to full fiber so until it's been connected and my, I get my internet back and right now I'm using my mobile network which is not fast enough because uh, I connect my tablet and my other phone so it's not really fast enough to edit and upload videos to YouTube. I'll see you very, very, I will see you very, very soon with another deck. Take care. Ciao. Bye bye.